The family of a teenager killed in a crash had his funeral today. He was one of three Meadow Creek High School students killed in the crash Friday night. Channel 2 Sophia Choi is live in southeast Atlanta. That's where the funeral was held. And Sophia, you spoke to a friend of the students. Yeah, Jovita, he was one of dozens of students who came to this mosque today to say their final goodbyes. This is a program from the service which had family members remembering a perfect child. An emotional time for students, friends, and family who will miss 16 year old Nasir Awakil, among them, senior class president Erman Hasnovic. They always taught me to live life to the fullest. So I'm going to live on for them. Nasir and two of his classmates, 18 year olds Nelson Umanzor and Brandon Martinez, died in a crash after Friday night's football game at Meadow Creek High. 17 year old Messiah Allen survived and is in the hospital. Their friends say this is a big loss. Their leadership and their motivation and encouragement, they were always such high spirited kids and they were always just happy. You never seen them sad. Police say Brandon Martinez swerved on Steve Reynolds Boulevard to avoid a car and hit this tree. The area is now marked with a memorial. It's brought the school together and um, the community together and you know, We've all become more of a family than ever before, I guess. His family says this crowd is proof Nassim made an impact during his short life. He's the best of us. I mean, if you wanted to pick, paint a picture of a perfect child, in every sense of the way, that's Nassim. Now, students tell me these kids were leaders, academic overachievers who also played sports. One of them was even a vice president of his class. Nasir worked at Chick-fil-A and wanted to be an engineer. His family tells me that uh, he was a tech guy who always fixed things for them. We're live in Southeast Atlanta. Sophia Choi, Channel 2 Action News.